This episode of Geek Beat is brought to you by Citrix GoToAssist, the number one global market leader in remote support. Sign up for GoToAssist before October 10th to get another Citrix product free for six months. Hey guys, I'm Callie Lewis. And I'm John P. And on today's show, anything could happen. <laughs> new Tech has a new gadget to show off. They're here exclusively to show it live. It all starts now. Before we get into it, now New Tech gives great support for all their products, and I'm sure this new gadget that we're about to find out about, if you're the one who provides support for your employees and your clients and you want to simplify that process, use GoToAssist from Citrix. It's live, it's remote, you can do it from anywhere, anytime, and it's just easy. So how can you go wrong? And if you sign up today, before October 10th, you can get another Citrix tool for free for six months. So go to assist.com now. And now I'm gonna hop over here and learn all about this do tech thing. Hey guys, welcome, welcome to an episode. This is feeling a lot like the live show, it but is, it's really but it's a daily not. show. Well, welcome anyway. And, and, and welcome, welcome to, to Philip Nelson. Thank you, Callie and John. For the, <laughs> the magnificent namesake of Ye old Nelsonville control room. Exactly. Ye old, I like that. Yeah. Very, very uh, regal. <laughs> yes. Wow. It's, it's almost British, except for the way I say it. So but we, we, you're here today with all kind. You're full of all kinds of mystery and surprises. You know, usually I, I tell you exactly what I'm going to tell show you. But you know, you guys are typically very open and honest with us, and we get this mysterious email a, a few weeks ago. Hey, we want to show off something new, but we won't tell you what it is. Yeah. And despite all of our attempts <laughs> to find out, we're like, so uh, are there any like talking points? Is there anything we need to hear? <laughs> nope. And nope. Uh, it's all good. And just before this show, you guys were in here scheming and setting up, and you would not even let us take a look at it. So That's right. That's true. I'm chomping a bit right now to find out what you have. They had Dave Curley and Ken Tran in here just doing, I don't, we literally don't, we don't know, know what, because they went in here, shut the door, and would not let us in it's here. It's a little hard to intro a show when you don't know what's going on. So what do right. you have, Philip? Well, I'm not going to tell you quite yet. Ugh. I'm kidding. So, you know, <laughs> you guys, this is nothing new to you, but, you know, we live in a world that communicates through video. You know, yes. pictures worth a thousand words. Well, how many um, how many words is video worth? You know, and and we live in an era, a time when every kid is an expert in television, every business, the bigger businesses are already communicating through video and the ones that aren't know they need to. Yeah. Yeah. That's and true. so, you know, we made the TriCaster, which is now the most dominant portable live production system on the planet. And we have about four of them. Yes, you do. And you make this look great. Every every time you turn it on, you make I it I wouldn't good. say that, but okay. I'll say Callie makes yes, it look exactly. good. Okay, yeah. But anyway, you know, and so, you know, everybody speaks the language of video, and they know they need to if they don't. And so, you know, we wanted to make a TriCaster for all of those people that didn't have access to our pro line. That A TriCaster for everyone? TriCaster for everyone. So you get a TriCaster, you get a TriCaster, you get a TriCaster. Is that is that what we're doing? We're giving away TriCasters? Tri are No comments. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm so fired now, it's just scary. Right, right. Okay, two things about that. Number one, TriCasters are a little expensive for yes. just everyone. They are. And number two, they can be a little, I mean, you know, they won't even let me touch the TriCaster back there because right. it's got a lot of buttons and knobs on it. And also it's in a rack. And it's, and it's not quite portable, so yeah. I'm going to go ahead and get right into it. Okay. okay. We are going to, do, to, to show you guys the brand new TriCaster Mini. Mini? This is the TriCaster Mini. Actually, this is not the TriCaster Mini. This is a backpack. Yeah. That says but Mini on it. That's, that's the truth in advertising. You mean you fit a TriCaster in a backpack? Not only the TriCaster, I'm going to do something really cool. I know, do you have your phone handy, Callie? Oh, no. Okay. Somebody can get my Somebody phone Somebody grab now. Callie's phone. It's because on my desk. One of the problems with, with traditionally with live production is, you know, it's complicated, it's expensive, it's time consuming to set up, and you have to have, you know, large crews of people. Right. Yeah. So we want, I'm, I'm basically going to take this backpack and this little bag right here, and I'm going to set up an entire control room and studio in less than five minutes. What? No, that's not possible. 
Now how much would you pay? <laughs> oh, 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 Eddie dude. dropped Ken my just phone. throws her phone. <laughs> Good so, thing for that old stadium so, case. So now the one thing I do want to say is for through the magic of television, I'm gonna there's one little cheat I'm gonna do. Okay. Because we want you guys to be able to see the screen of the TriCaster. Oh, I have yeah. some cables taped. Oh. Okay. But other than that, this is a raw setup. From start to finish, Wait, under you five really, minutes. You really think right, you can do this in five oh, minutes? Uh, is that what my phone is for? You're to gonna time be my timer you? because you're gonna show the people that it actually. If if I'm racing against the clock, I have a stopwatch right here. On your awesome, awesome. On my little right. Galaxy Fit. So you really, so you really want us to do this? You know what? Let's try five this. Minutes. Okay. All right. You tell me when to start. Oh, All right. Hang on. My screen went to sleep. You ready? Three, yep. two. One go. All right. So not all, like I said, not only am I am I going to set up the TriCaster, but I'm also setting up the entire studio. And this is oh the my god, oh, that is wow. awesome looking. I like your reaction. So uh, let's see. It's got a screen on it. Tiny. It's got HDMI outputs and inputs. It's got four HDMI video ins, two HDMI video outs. It's got audio in, a microphone, wow. and left and right. So I guess, and headphones left and right, I guess you could actually put a little mixer into it if you wanted to. You're plugging in, what, a monitor? These are, this, is, this is actually just a, a portable battery-operated monitor. So let's go ahead and turn a this. But the monitor doesn't come with it. No. So you just added a little, like, USB kind of... Is that a USB... Wait, that's a GoPro. Is that a USB monitor? Uh, or is the monitor, monitor literally? The monitor is an HDMI monitor. It literally has a battery. Yes. I've never even seen that. So that's a little... <laughs> How That's much something is we that have to thing? look into. Um, it's, it's, it's available just, we got it from like B&H for a couple okay. hundred bucks. So it's uh, not, we'll have to look crazy. into that. Callie's going to Three minutes, one. 55 seconds. All right. Left. Left, yes, there we go. That's one. Yes, we're yeah, a minute and 10 seconds right? in. Okay, so we've got a GoPro Hero 3. We've got a little Manfrotto tripod. Okay, we've got a little This Acer laptop computer. is just for something extra. Just okay. to like feed in stuff to it or whatever. Yep. All right, so now the TriCaster is pretty much set up. So now it's time to set up the studio. So the first thing we need in our studio, because we're setting up a full um, television studio here in just a few minutes. Okay. Uh -huh. We got to set up a green screen. So let's do that first. Oh. You're gonna, <laughs> you're gonna set up the I told green you, screen. I'm not, I'm, I'm, we're, we're not just setting up the TriCaster in five minutes. I'm setting up the entire studio, studio. for you guys. So there we that go. That would be ridiculous. If this actually works. Um, there he's pulling out the green screen. He's got some hooks there. That's a pretty okay. cool little green screen. That is. Oh, wow. Oh, look at that. I I've never seen nifty. that, actually. Well, now how much would he's got a lot. Yeah, he's got a lot of little tricks up his sleeve here. Where'd you get that? Um, okay. All these things are just easily available. I mean, yeah. this you know, 150 bucks or something <gasps> like that. It's not, nothing, uh, nothing groundbreaking. But you know, what's you groundbreaking. two minutes, 38 seconds left. No. All right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, you're two minutes and 25 seconds into it. No. Yeah. We have a discrepancy on the clock. <laughs> you're confusing me, John. You're halfway there. You're halfway to the finish line. Okay, so we've got another camera going up over there on the tripod. Not, now I'm setting up lights. Now, okay, and he's got, not even hurrying. Look that's at the this. thing. Like, I mean, he's just taking his good old time. Yeah. It's my Texas ways. Right. <laughs> I like uh, just sitting back and watching somebody else do yeah, all the work. Yeah, seriously. Usually we're having to do all the work. Okay, we're right. three minutes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. So we're actually three, we're three minutes in. Usually the team is having to do all the work. We're three minutes in. Uh-huh. Actually, that means I'm going to finish early. Wow. Really? You, I think you're so. You're seeming awfully confident there. <laughs> well, dude, I mean, uh, you know, the thing is, is you don't want to be stressed. No, so no don't you don't want to be stressed. Here goes the light. Okay, he's got some little Lights. LED light panels okay. there. Okay. And you know what? I have one more thing to do, and I'm done. And that's tighten but up this. Because you have to boot have up to the boot machine. It up and everything. And it's already doing. Stuff. It's already there. Oh. It's booting up while I sit here and chat with you guys. <laughs> uh, where's the power to the machine? It's um, uh, on the back. It's on the back over there. Oh, okay, right. you guys, got it plugged in and everything. We are officially set up. Time. How much did we do? That was three minutes and forty-three left. seconds. Wow. And six tenths. Not bad, huh? 
I mean, how many shows have you done where it takes you more than five minutes to set up? Um, every single one. <laughs> Thousands. <laughs> okay, you really... Uh... Oh, you know what? If I want to take the time penalty, I can turn on the cameras. Okay. Oh, okay, that's true. I'll, okay. Take a, I'll take a 30-second time penalty we'll say, for pushing two buttons. We'll say that it took you four minutes then. Okay, four minutes. That's not bad, though. No, that's All pretty right. impressive. Uh, now, that's Oops. good to be, able to, to be able to set it up as one thing, but can I work it? Yes. So, because uh, that's the other that's the other thing. So here's here's the thing about TriCaster. You know, TriCaster. There, we 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 talk about making television making television easy, but what does it mean to make something look like television? What are the different pieces right. that are required to make something look like television? And that definition changes as it we does. move along, right? Yeah. Well, it, but like for example, if you watch our live show, you'd be like, ha, 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 anybody can do this. <laughs> This Tough looks crowd. like crap, but other than that, yeah. <laughs> well, you know, there's a, there's four things that we feel are like the important key pieces to make it look like TV, and the first one is multi-camera. You okay, know, yeah. instead of like being able to cut back and forth with yeah. a gray wall behind you. Right. Uh, if you're a, a business and you're trying to communicate something, you know, I can set, I can shoot a video of you standing in front of a gray wall. And what is the value that that video has to someone looking at it? What is, do they respect your message? Does it add to the story or does it detract from the story? Mm -hmm. And so with multi-camera, if I have a wide shot and a close-up, we can actually make our video look a little more interesting. So in the TriCaster, switching video cameras look at this is... monitor. I can't see it. You've got a monitor built into the this is, TriCaster yeah, this, this monitor can be a multiple things and I, you know, y'all are, Pulling me out of my demo, but that's I fine. Know, sorry. Feel free. Um, hammer me with questions. But we can actually assign what this screen um, displays. So, uh, so you've got right now. You've got that screen showing the output. Yeah, that's the output. Whatever we're gonna yeah. like feed to someone or be recording for later. Well, look at this. I can make it a clock. Nice. Oh, nice. I can make it a countdown clock. I can make it a waveform monitor vector scope. So we have a lot of cool t tools in here. But, you know, the, the, the first thing that we feel is important to make it look like TV is multiple cameras. And it's as simple as saying, I want to, I've got two cameras hooked up to this TriCaster. I've got the uh, GoPro here starring John P. and Callie Lewis. <laughs> All right. And then I have another camera here. Scott, I'm going to recruit Scott in to be my lovely spokesmodel. Yes. Nice. Um, Scott, if you come would on come, in, Scott. Just stand in here so we have something on screen other than green screen. I got it. Nice. Okay. <laughs> nice. But you did, you, you charge right. more than ten thousand dollars, right? I don't get what is the quote? I don't get out of bed for ten thousand dollars. For less than, than ten thousand dollars. All right, so there's Scott. So now you can see that we have two cameras and using the TriCaster is so simple. I just pick <laughs> camera one is live, camera two is up next. Okay. Uh -huh. And if I just hit the enter key, it cuts back and forth. Nice. Now I want to warn warn you. This we've got Scott double lit. Since I've set this up, y'all have the studio lit. Yeah, that's yeah. Have lighting. So, he's a little so this bright. is Scott playing the part of Casper. Right. Um, <laughs> but but you know it's as simple as hitting the inner key to cut from camera to camera. Right. Why did you make him stand in front of the green screen? Well, just because I want him there. Okay. But, but, but you, you gonna, can also you key out. Take out the green screen. I will in a minute. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. We're We're building, jumping. man. I'm building. Oh, jumping up. Come on, man. I'm, let me build here. <laughs> so, uh, so you know, we can we can cut our cameras back and forth very easily with the. I love the karate moves, Scott. Yeah, it's pretty nice. And, but we don't just have to do. Um, we just don't have to do um, cuts. We can actually do. You know, by hitting the space Fades. bar instead of the inner key, we can we can cross oh, fade. Oh, nice. transitions. Ooh. Okay, but you know, as you know, the TriCaster has built-in high-end transitions, so we can not only do um, cross fades, but we can do 3D effects. And you know, if it's a business, they want to add in their corporate branding into their transitions. You can do that as well. So oh, there yeah. you see the, the shameless nice. plug of the new yes. tech of transition. So that's the first thing. That's a good transitions. Transition. Okay, or, or, or multi-camera with transitions. That's the first piece to yeah. make it look like okay. TV. Second. The second is graphics. You know, you yep. want to introduce your, your, your CEO. Lower thirds. Lower thirds. So sure it's as simple as, um, here's John and Callie on camera. And so if I hit the A key, all that does is fade in our lower third. Oh, and, nice. And notice I hey, gave myself the nothing. title of expert. Nice. Um, <laughs> but let's see. Um, we can and and we have a, our our system is set up so it's all template based. So with just click by simply clicking on the gear, we can actually change this to Callie and John. And I'm gonna. No, you're not an expert. You're experts. So right. <laughs> right. 
All right, so uh, so you know now we so can bring in and out our lower thirds. Okay. Very simple, and you know what? I, I did have it reversed, but so what? That's all right. Um, <laughs> he so, can be Callie uh, for a day. Yeah, right. Callie. He, he's always wanted to be Callie. For I, a day. I have. Today is that day. He likes to pretend. Do my do Callie voice. Oh no. Hi, I'm Callie Lewis. <laughs> we have derailed completely. I'm very scared right now. So, but you know, we can also bring in. It doesn't have to be a crossfade. You can actually uh, use transitions to bring in our lower thirds. Oh. And I'm only hitting like three little buttons on the keyboard. That's what's cool. You know, the A key is bringing in the uh, the the graphic in whatever transition I select. So the first two are multi camera. The first is multi-camera, second is graphics, the third is video roll-ins. As, as you well know, it, it's, it's great to stand on camera and talk about stuff, but it's nice, it's nice to have when supporting have a, video. Yeah, exactly. Show a YouTube Assets video or something. Exactly. You're, you're, you're talking about it, show it. So, it's video after So all. today, Callie and John show is going to be talking about tablets. Okay. okay. Let's talk you know about tablets. Bit. So yes. tablets. Well, what's we cool enjoy is so we're bringing the show together. Um, so Scott is the, is the guy that's going to intro them. He says, hi, this is Callie and John. So we have Callie and John hi. on camera. We bring in their lower third. Now I want to bring in a video clip that's already been um, pre-edited. Okay. And so let's say Callie and John are now going to talk about We're tablets. talking about tablets. You know, these things are great. You can use them on the go. They're and square. And you can see how easy they are to use and work with. They have screens. <laughs> but what's cool is in the TriCaster, it has a virtual tape operator. I'm not going to touch anything, and you're going to see at the end of this clip, it automatically comes oh, back to you nice. and John. Oh, wow. And it cues up the next tablet, the, the next video, oh, wow. which, is, which is going to be about statistics. So you can basically Hey, the big TriCaster doesn't do that, show. does it? Oh, it, oh does? it does? Yeah, it does. They don't, we don't, know. I don't, we don't, they don't know let me touch does. the big TriCaster. <laughs> Here's what's cool about this TriCaster Mini. I said we're bringing this to just about anyone. Uh -huh. We're bringing the power of the full pro line of TriCaster, but now making it portable and affordable and easier to... What's missing? Like, what, what, what... What are you taking out to accomplish this? Um, I mean, SDI inputs. You know, this is the, okay. you know, HDMI inputs on the cameras. It doesn't have removable hard drives. So there's right. some, you know, le there's four inputs instead of eight, or there's less audio channels. But the, the but idea the functionality is, oh, is all there. The power is under the hood. What is and, this thing on the top for? Um, this. I have to ask. You know what? That's a great question. I know I question, derailed you. <laughs> no, <laughs> you didn't really derail me. Show the handle. Not doing so my this job. is a handle for yeah, one. It's a handle. But one of the problems that are it's sometimes it's the simplest things are such brilliant inventions. But you know the problem with HDMI cables is they're not a locking professional cable. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And so if somebody trips over a cable, oops, it's we just gonna, lost a cable. Oh, yeah. shizzle. Okay, that's not good. So. I can actually take this off, and this becomes a cable lock. Oh, on the so front. sweet. And okay. So, so now oh. when John trips over the cable, it's going to hold it in. And That's so cool. it's, it's the little things in life, isn't it? It is John? indeed. That's a brilliant move. It really is. And, and also is the, are the left and right uh, jacks here, is that honestly like, that's like for, that's, so, you so have I a, could take a mixer and I could plug yeah. in left and yep. right and I could have four microphones on uh, connected yeah, to my mixer? You, you have one mic in, so yep. it's a mic level in, and then you have two a stereo line level and so you can have your left and right line level. And, and I can go out too. Yes. So like, does that, why would I go out to like a AV a system in a room Let's like say, a PA? You know, yeah. Cause you know, we talk, we always, we, we think of live streaming and I'm kind of bouncing around here. Yeah, sorry. But that's good. Uh, you know, it, it doesn't just output to the webcast. You can output live to LCDs, yep. mm -hmm. projectors, you know. So if you're in a, a conference room doing training, you can, you know, have. You can run it all through your. You totally caster. could. You could have a guy or a, a presenter with PowerPoint. You could be streaming it live to the web. You could be sending it out to projectors and screens in the room, and also recording it to the hard drive, so that employees that weren't there for that session can now watch it later. That's crazy. So it's pretty cool. So we talked about three things. Oh, wait, yeah. I got to roll in one more video clip just for okay. fun because I want to <laughs> hear you make up some statistics. Oh, right. Oh, so okay. John and Callie have talked about tablets, and let's talk about how tablets have been adopted. And you have five seconds on this clip. <laughs> Go. Uh, you know, tablets have grown over the last four years. By 47%. Wow, that's a great... 27%. The I was size, getting there. Five uh, seconds is not very long. But, you know, what's cool is it's actually, si now you can talk about how they're adopted all around the world. And I'm only hitting one Everybody button Everybody the in the world is using this them. This is the spread of the Ebola of virus, people. which uh, has recently it's, made its way to Antarctica, believe it wow. or not. That's where it's gotten to lately. Don't spread The don't penguins. Spread lies. You know, I, I, penguins. I, I, I've been making jokes about I'm coming to Ebola ground zero. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so uh, thanks for bringing that up, yeah. John. It's a pain. You're scaring my children. Yeah. Thanks a lot. And, 
Which they're probably by the way, watching we, right now. we were interviewing the other guy that, that actually spread it. So he was, he was feeling fine. I don't he know was, why was right. people are, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so how, how about those uh, derails? Cowboys. <laughs> so anyway. Um, so you know, but what's cool is on the on the the video playback, all I'm doing is hitting the space bar, one button, yeah. and it's cycling through my playlist so that you know you could do it on your own if you wanted to. So it you can prep it all. Like if I knew that I was going to do these five stories and I had five assets to support them, it, I line them up ahead of time. Mm -hmm. Then as I'm going through my points, I hit the space bar. That's it. And you're saying when I hit the space bar, it pulls it right in. It transitions right yeah, in for that amount of time. Here, John. Why don't you hit the space bar? Uh, look, Dave. I like you. Oh, I give the, the space the bar. <laughs> I get the, the space bar. So hit the space bar and roll that roll that okay, beautiful iPhone footage. I hit the space footage. bar. Wow. And look, now and it's going to count it down. It's seven seconds. Six, five, four. And I'll be four. talking about. You don't even have to touch it again. iPhones oh, bend a ma magnificently well. <laughs> oh. And that's it. And we're and done. And it's back. So it's it's that simple. Huh. That's pretty cool. Okay. So cool. so we've talked about the three key three of the key things. You One is recording. multiple camera. Oh. You know, two is is graphics, three is video roll-ins, and the fourth is special effects. Because once again, we're all TV experts. Even my kids are TV experts, even though they don't know the you know white balance and multicam, they don't know all those terms. But when they watch a show, they can tell the difference, and anyone can. Mm -hmm. So special effects are something to really up your production value, make it look more like TV in a very easy way. Is Scott about to do something fun? He's getting ready to. I can't tell you. <laughs> He's going to do cartwheels. No, nice. Right. So, but before I do that, you know, one of the one thing that's important when you're doing business presentations or even web television is sometimes you need to bring in something from a laptop. So yeah. we just have a like a, a PowerPoint a, or something. Yeah. yeah. Have you ever seen a PowerPoint? Are you big fans? Yeah, yeah. not really. You probably yeah. fall asleep. <laughs> How do I answer yeah. that yeah. correct? Yeah. So, but what's cool <laughs> is especially when we're doing one. Exactly. Woo, those are so bad. So I just have a laptop, and we have this technology called IVGA, and so in the TV studios, they use this device called a scan converter, which takes your computer screen, turns it into something video can use. Well, we do that through Ethernet. So all I have is just a cable plugged into my TriCaster that's an Ethernet cable, crossover cable. Okay. And you'll notice that whatever's on this screen is now available as a, uh, I think I may have just unplugged my Ethernet cable. Like as a, ca like as a camera input. Yeah. Let's see here. I shouldn't have picked it up. I, I, exactly. Uh, never, never, never touch okay, it. Okay, so here it is. it is. So you'll see that we have whatever's on this laptop is now uh, a source on the TriCaster. But what's cool is that can be anything. So let's say we want to run the most amazing PowerPoint presentation ever. So you and I, let's say we're on, y'all are on camera and you're like, today's, uh, we're going to talk about successful business planning. So we're seeing this PowerPoint play in real time. You know, it's okay. I mean, it's still boring. It's 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 a, a, a <laughs> it's, static it's a presentation. Twenty three percent of people give stat give static PowerPoint presentations, 23? but the smart ones actually run them through their TriCaster, mm. and they like switch it. back and forth using <laughs> GoPro wide angle super video. So, but I want it to look better than that. Okay. Okay. okay so now okay, we can I'll turn get on. off the stage. No, no. Now <laughs> stop. Oh. <laughs> so now my PowerPoint is is finished running its cycle. And I'm just gonna I'm gonna run it again, but this time I'm gonna put it into a special effect called a double box. Oh. So now you're on camera talking oh. about it, so it just br brings in that look of television. Yep. Everybody that watches cable news or national news, they've seen this look, and they may not know what a double box effect is or picture in picture, but it once but again it, it just makes it look it. more professional, professional and polished, and hopefully helps people stay awake a little more because and they get to look keep, at Callie and John. That's right. Just the yeah. Same. You can keep. Actually, we're on the doing screen. the double box effect of you. Uh, um, is it? Oh, the, Dave, can you throw that It's into, a double box of a Dave. double box. Can we do a yes. double box of a double box? Yeah, Dave, throw that into a, like a double box. <laughs> and it's like Inception. So this could also be, Newception. it doesn't have to be PowerPoint. It could be video clips from YouTube. It could be, you know, video from Skype. So here we have Anna Castro as our guest. And so, you know, this is this is the way our story could, could be told. So Callie and John are on camera, and they're getting ready to go live with a special guest, Anna Castro, and she's going to talk about her new book. Hey, Anna, we hear that you have an amazing book. Tell us about it. And then we cut to that. She talks about her amazing book. Stick her back in a box. We <laughs> give her a title. Oh, yeah, give her a title. Then we stick her back in a box. 
And then she Co- says, yeah, see you later. And now we're back to Kelly and John. But the cool thing is that I'm hitting three things on the keyboard. That's yeah. it. It's so simple yeah. to do now. And it has the double boxes. But now. So maybe you should come out with a keyboard that only has three buttons. You actually, <laughs> three button you can keyboard. Do that. Or just put a little sticker on the ones that right. matter. That's how you know, much does this cost? <laughs> the I want to know how much Mini this costs. Retails, they start at $59.95. So okay. under six grand, and it comes with the TriCaster Mini, the keyboard, and the mouse, and you just have to add your monitor. You throw in a monitor, plug yeah. in your cameras. So two more things to okay. show you. Sorry, oh, okay. Okay. Then we're going to be done. Um, this is why Scott is here. Um, so we have Scott on the green screen, and he looks very ninja-like. And I want to do a green screen shot, but if you look, we just set this green screen up in the corner of your studio, threw up a couple of lights, yeah. Yeah. and you know I didn't really do a lot of calibration on the lighting. I, you know, one we got of lights. Well, we got double of lights and everything else. But, but that's I want okay. to turn on green screen, so the key may not be perfect. I'm going to go ahead and warn you. All right. And we're just going to turn it on and see how it looks. Well, that's not too bad. That's pretty yeah, good. That's pretty good actually for the um, situation we have here. Yes, it's not bad at all. Great. Um, actually, I'm going to I'm going to do one thing. I'm just going to. I'm gonna I'm gonna select the color green because um, you can actually do use a color picker, and uh, so you're basically telling the system this is what is green, this yes. is what I want you to remove from the backdrop. Yep. And so now we've pulled out his green, and this is not perfect lighting, so it's not gonna be perfect. But you'll see that we still the camera was the green screen wasn't wide enough for the camera. Okay. Right. So I can actually. Hang on, what happens if I stick my hand in here? Your hand will be key. There you go. <laughs> but what's That's cool? That's freaky. But How it does that in real time? We, can, we don't. We not even zoom in. I can just crop out the garbage on the left side, and I can crop out the garbage on the right side. That's amazing. And isn't it? now we have uh, we have Scott. Nice. But what's cool is if we put him in a virtual set. Now Scott oh, is interviewing <laughs> Anna in a multi-million dollar studio. Now, I know you guys have an unbelievable facility, and we're in a real studio. Right, but, but, but virtual set it doesn't look like place. that. This yeah. could be done in a conference room. This right. could be done in your control room. Mm-hmm. So we, our goal is to take, you know, if you're a corporate, you know, doing a corporate product launch, and you just want to make it look bigger, you want to look more polished, you want to look yeah. like you're in a big studio, you can. And you want because to be the, on a boat. You, want to, you can be on a boat, and I wanted you to do the wrap when we do that I Wanted to be on a boat. <laughs> so, uh, so anyway, so what's cool is in our virtual set technology, you can actually zoom the camera in. It doesn't have to just be static. So yeah. we're actually zooming the camera in on Scott and Anna, and you know it looks like we're in a million dollar studio. So that's that's pretty cool. It comes awesome. with like twenty virtual sets, so that you can actually uh, you know pick different which different virtual sets. But you can also um, uh, let me just pick a different virtual set just to show you that. And then I'm going to show you one more thing, and then, then we'll Could wrap Could you make it up. your own, too? Oh, nice. yeah. Oh. But now he's in more of a kind of a new style virtual right. set. Um, let's see here. Okay. This is called a holographic virtual set. Ooh, I like okay. um, you, I, I, yeah, I'm sure you have taken a panoramic photo before. Yes. All right, so watch this. If I take a panoramic photo of, uh, let's see here. I'm gonna. Go, I'm on camera three. Just one second. Okay. So if I if I go to our, our our holographic virtual sets, we can actually import a panoramic photo, map okay. it to the inside of of, uh, of the virtual sets, and now Scott is standing in the courtyard in front of the Eiffel Tower. Oh, so there cool. he is. Hey Scott, how's it going there in Paris today? Uh, it's, the weather's great. You know, people are friendly. <laughs> that is awesome. That is. I insane. didn't know you could do panoramas. Is that yeah, new? Yeah, this is this is something that's pretty new. Now I have a video in the screen of Kiki because we can't have two people in the virtual sets. If I had two green screens, oh, I'd wow. have two different sources. So I'm gonna I'm gonna roll some video of Kiki. Okay. And then I, for fun, I'm going to. Um, put in load up a different virtual set. So now we have Scott as our barista. Um, he's behind the bar and, uh, you know, and we can zoom the camera out or pull the camera out and we'll see Kiki standing in the foreground. So, nice. and then, you know, because it is a panoramic photo, we can pan around the Arboretum and Wait, then come back to the on. group. You that just is totally... Insane. Wait, you have her on a green screen, a totally different a video clip, of clip of her of in a green screen. You got him on a totally different green screen. Yep. And you have them both superimposed into a 3D image that you're painting around. That's right. Can you do the same thing like in live? Like she's in oh, kind of yeah. in via Skype yeah. or whatever. This is this could be all this is because I only have one green screen here. I'm just using a video clip. Yeah. But you could so you could put whatever you want in that that second channel. Or if you had a giant green screen and you had five people, you could 
grab each one of them individually? I would say in, in this version, two is a good goal. Like two, okay, okay. all right, okay. Uh, so, two is a good goal. Okay, so <laughs> two people, and you could like uh, just independently, even though they're both standing side by side on one green screen, you can move them around in your yeah. virtual world. Yeah, you but can you position can them. Like, uh, you know, Can you turn them buddies, upside down well, and like have them hanging upside Tom, down? Tom, one of, one of our cool friends in New Tech, Tom Green, we were joking about the virtual, holographic virtual sets, and he said, next time I'm at Jimmy Kimmel's studio, I'm just gonna do a panorama. <laughs> And then yeah. I'm gonna load it, load it into the TriCaster. I'll be like, "Hey, we're here live in nice. Jimmy Kimmel." Yeah. Until he gets the cease and desist letter. So. Right. Exactly. Of course, of course. But uh, you know, but now the cool thing is, you can do more is, than two on the eight thousand. Mm -hmm. Or okay. Yeah. So, on the so as you get into the pro line, yeah. you can do tons and tons yeah. of layers. But this TriCaster Mini, you know, odds are, you know, we've given them the power they need to make a show look like TV. Give it that polish of network television, but make it easy enough and portable enough that if they're a corporate marketing department, they don't have a full-time studio, they can put the backpack oh, in yeah. a closet, bring it out when they need to do a CEO message or a stockholder update or a training session, and then put it back in the backpack and hide it in a closet. Yeah. So you know. Awesome. So now that we've talked about making the show, um, there's a couple ways you can get your show out, and I kind of mentioned it earlier. I mean, we can come out live from HDMI. I mean, through the HDMI outputs, and we can go to LCDs, so you can mm -hmm. have them in your venue, closed closed circuit TV in your company, um, projectors in a church. You can also go out live to the web, so you can do live webcasts, and then you can also record it to the hard drive as full HD video so that you can either make DVDs, make it available on demand. You have a lot of choices and we've also included the social media sharing features so that while my show's live I could be publishing to YouTube clips to YouTube, Facebook and Twitter. What do you mean clips? Like I could mark some clips and actually while my show's still live I could, you know, let's say it's a football game. Okay. And they're coming out of the half and it's been a great half. You could have put some clips in your DDRs you could share those out, so there's like watch the second half. Okay, hang on a minute. So let's CSA say goals. we were let's say we were doing a sporting event, like you said. Yeah. We were watching a football game. Uh huh. Somebody just scored a touchdown. We could say, share that. Grab touchdown. the ten seconds before, like that play that resulted in touchdown. Yeah, we could, could mark it, and through it. the system, we could say share it to YouTube. Yes. And. And while we're while still we're live, that. you're telling me the box yep. has the ability yep. to transcode that thing, yep. pro it's, export it, it, it. What about titling? Upload it. No, it's just it's, it's no, just, just going to now, now, if if your show when you were recording the show, if you were putting titles in, those would all be. You basically you're okay. just taking the content that's the program content of the TriCaster and sharing pieces while it's live. It's really pretty cool. <laughs> it's really cool. So if we were doing our regular show, and I did something stupid. Everyone can know which happens the a lot, show. Nice. right? Let's let's yeah. face it. Somebody could go in and grab just that thing while we're live and go. John P just did this stupid thing and <laughs> and just send it straight out of you the TriCaster. You just create the John P does stupid things on YouTube channel and <laughs> yeah. publish live. And you just from bang bang, bang every show. stupid thing he does. <laughs> That's that a crowd pleaser. Really, really yeah, cool. it is. But you know, it is really cool. So one other thing that's included that I this it's my grand finale. Stop! You're, it's like, you're filling my head I know. too much. Right. It's almost like a Ron Popeil commercial. <laughs> right. It's like now, how much would you <laughs> yeah, pay? Exactly. Order now, get your bamboo owl wind chimes. <laughs> Spray on yeah, hair. I know. <laughs> Couvre. Do you remember that? Um, anyway, oh, wait, so we have completely about? derailed. <laughs> so, uh, but you know, we actually include a lot of power under the hood. And so the idea in the TriCaster Mini is to make this available and accessible to anyone. Easy to use, portable, affordable. I mean, you're replacing you know six figures plus worth of equipment. Yeah. yeah. But we also want to have enough power under the hood that it's not a device that somebody buys and uses for six months and outgrows. Yep. So we, you know, with all the layering and stuff that I've shown, you can get very complicated in there if you choose to. And there's a feature um, uh, we have automation built in. So like, let's say it's one person that wants to do a show. And so they want to pre-set up the entire show and then just go stand in front of the green screen and do it. I have a keyboard shortcut call, that's I call my finale. Okay. And this is my finale. Um, you know what? I, I thought about putting Callie in there, but Scott, you're doing so good with the karate moves. I just want to leave you there. I'm just going to do Control Alt F for finale. Okay. And what this is going to do, let me reset. I'm just going to reset it back to the factory defaults here, so it goes through and it kind of configures it back to when we started. And I'm going to do Control Alt F. And what it does, I'm not going to touch anything. It brings up our, our, our title graphic. So New Tech TriCaster Mini around the world. Scott, you're live in three, two, one, and you're live. Hey, everybody. Check it out. We're at the Eiffel Tower in Paris checking out some amazing new technology. My name's Scott Carroll, and today we're I'm not touching the it. TriCaster Mini from New Tech. 
lets people from around the world tell stories <laughs> in new and creative ways. So you're not gonna want to miss this. Don't go anywhere. Thanks for coming. Hi, mom. <laughs> All right, but you see, I, so I could set up a complicated intro, yeah. and what's cool about that, let's say you're doing live from some awesome show, you could you could set up your intro so that it cuts to GoPros throughout your set, right. yeah. so that you're bringing in the audience and integrating the audience, yeah. and we're live from XYZ show, yeah. and the crowd goes crazy, and it's all live, and they're tweeting out, I'm live on, on Geek Beat. Yeah. Cool. So that's the idea, with the, and that, that, that power is under the hood of the TriCaster Mini, so that, you know, for fifty nine ninety five, you have a very powerful live production solution that has tons of growth potential as your needs grow. But within thirty minutes, anybody can be up and running and doing their own live webcast out of a back. That is crazy. Set up in five minutes, actually four and a half minutes. Yeah, yeah that's it right. It was really four, but it was yeah. it really, it was really four? four. But then you had to. Turn well, it was the like camera. three minutes and forty seconds, and then you gave you gave yourself a thirty second penalty. But I don't think that GoPro takes that long to turn on. Right. So that's good. <laughs> But, I mean, that's it. This yeah. is the wow. TriCaster Mini, and, you know, I'm excited to be here. This is the first live look at TriCaster Mini anywhere in the world. It's been top secret, and it's right here on Geek Beat TV. Well, thanks well, we for doing that it. with us. Yes, that is incredible, and I can see why you've been so super secretive about yeah. it. Yeah, when can people get one? Yes. Today. Really? But when will they actually be available to ship? Today. Wow. You have these manufactured yeah. and ready to go in a box. We're not pre no pre it does it's, sound it's like available. a Ron Popeil no, commercial. No, it's today. <laughs> it is available now. <laughs> Call your reseller. Buy a TriCaster Mini today. Actually, the, Tell we, them John and Callie they, sent they, you. they are shipping today, and our resellers have stock. They they pre-ordered stock, so if you know, they're going to be in hot demand. So you yeah. know. The, if you just now find out about it today and you call your dealer tomorrow, they're, they're, they're they initial may or may be sold yeah. out. But we're, we're producing them awesome. as fast as we can, and, and it and is And hey, if you're now. in Canada, go uh, get it from Videolink. Yeah. Does it include Actually, the backpack? No. Because you're back, oh. you have the a sweet new tech awesome. backpack. Yeah, this is a sweet OGO backpack yeah. that uh, we had made, but uh, I'm sure that there may be some backpacks available somewhere. Okay. <laughs> I hear Dave Curley yelling dibs from the control room. Oh, okay, guys, right. I don't know what to tell you. That was awesome. Uh, that was truly our first look at the new TriCaster Mini. So uh, for Let under six know. grand, let's yeah. say, for uh, I want to just think this through. Sorry, we were. I was about to wrap this up, but now I got to pull back. Not. I got to okay. pull back for a second. Pull back. So let's say that's about six grand. Okay. And then we spend a couple hundred bucks on a monitor. Uh, we might want, let's say, three cameras. I want at least three cameras. Yeah. I'm going to say cameras are going to cost you 500 bucks a piece because yep. I want you to have decent cameras. Right. Um, so that's uh, with cabling, a couple of tripods. We're up to maybe seven. Uh, 78. Eight grand. Eight. We'll call it eight grand. Yeah. Green screen is one. Green, about green screen. Yeah. You yeah. need some LED lights and stands. Let's Under say a maybe. Grand. Yeah, under a grand. So we're you're under way 10 under grand. ten. We're way what, under ten. So what's great about that? Room. If you're looking at like business video, yeah, you pay your company and you want to do a marketing video. You're going to spend ten grand on one video. And so with the TriCaster Mini, you can afford everything you need to do all of the aspects of yeah. this video for less than the price of producing one video. And what's cool about that, let's say, you know, six months later, you want to do training, you want to do, you know, tr you know uh, a message to your employees that are remote. Now you have this in the can, ready to go yep. to, to do live. One other thing I didn't mention is there's two versions of the TriCaster Mini. Okay. There's one for $59.95 that has um, 15 hours of recording and does not have the screen on the side. Oh, okay. Okay. And there's one for seventy nine ninety five that has forty five hours of recording and has the screen on the side. Okay. So okay. you can pick whichever one. So you want. if you get whichever the eight thousand dollar version, then with everything else, you're right about ten grand. Yeah. Right. With everything, you're still you're still under the price of one single marketing yeah. video. Cool. It's pretty amazing. Very okay. Cool. Now we can now wrap, we can it, wrap up. it up. All right. Now that we have that under control. Thank you guys so much for joining in on the live stream because we live streamed this and watching the recorded version later. And if you have any questions, comment below. We will be paying attention and we'll try and get all the answers for you. That and is of course, true. Uh, we're going to be <clears throat> testing this, right? I'm yeah, I, I, going to just hold on to that. Wait, it's plugged uh, in. <laughs> oh, well, I guess we'll let him get it unplugged. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks, Philip, for Phillip coming Nelson, over, guys. At Philip Nelson. Thumbs up on YouTube. Bye. Two, if you got them. I almost, I oh, almost no. didn't do it. Deal? I don't know. If someone ever manages to hack their way into your account and get at your files, they'd have to find a way to do it. <laughs> Awesome. This is a 
PTZ camera and uh, you can see up there it 